unfortunately guys the first part of this video uh corrupted so uh i'm gonna just gonna get straight into the next clip and video Okay, so as you saw in that time lapse, I moved the setup around, and I think that this is going to be good when we're working on the trenches, guys. If you like this, tell me if the view is good. I'm going to make it slightly higher so that you can see more of them, uh, uh, this part of the mock. Um, but what we're going to do now is I've got a bunch of these, like not like a ton of them, and they're going to come along the uh, uh, outside of that on top of these as I said before so uh, we're gonna get into another time lapse in a second uh, with that um first things first though I want to know do you like uh, the uh, pieces here the little segments on here to be about this big because I think that this is a good size around about this size is gonna be good not with a couple of smaller ones around on the inside like one coming here which is smaller but relatively large ones is what I prefer because then it's going to take less of these and I might not have to buy more of them. Um, I've still got an absolute ton of them in here, as you can see. So I've probably got enough for... I've got at least enough for this section and maybe the middle section. Um, but really what I do want to do maybe get done is the um, larger... The same size as this is the same section. Um, so it's the same size section. So it's like... Uh, two of these base plates by three of them um and i might want to try and go on to that so that maybe we get a smaller part and then we work on the middle part last tell me about that guys uh, for now let's get into another time lapse uh, of these let's go And here is the finished product. So these are what the trenches are looking like so far. I'm really liking it. We've still got a lot of these pieces left. So we might be able to do something else with uh, it. For now, I think what I'm going to be doing now is filling in more along here with these pieces. And some more of these pieces, you know, filling in with some more red pieces in the trench. So we can get some more detail done here. Because this week I want to do a lot more. Because last week was a little disappointing probably for you guys. As uh, I didn't get a load done. So um, I'm just going to go and find some pieces. And we'll get straight into a time lapse. Actually just a thought came to mind. This here. This space here. This here needs to get filled in. I know this is going to be boring for you guys. But I'm going to get straight into a time lapse of filler bricks and let's try and get this all covered use some of these pieces get this all down for the salt flats let's go ahead and get straight into the time lapse
Okay, so I've done a bit more work on this as you saw in those two time lapses. And yeah, we've got we've got quite a bit done right now. Um we've got some uh some salt flats that we need to do. I'm thinking you might have seen my hand being waved around here. I was thinking something like that and then coming in. So if I just show you just as a baseline. So something if if I was gonna go like this but then make that like that. So you could bring it in like that. So if we go like that. A bit like this. Now here there'd be like a smaller segment which could connect a couple of pieces together like so oh that isn't very sturdy i'm gonna have to look at that this here i'm gonna have to look at right here i might need to bring this up so i can support it as you can see it's floppy so i might need to sort that out but other than that that will go there um, I'd then maybe move this slightly over so that it makes more of a better circle here. Move this over into here so that it comes inwards. Um, I could do that now for you guys quickly. Just so that you can see how it would look. Um, because I want it, I want it to be a bit like, there you go, like that. Then that will come out more like that. Because the next segment here will then come in. The next uh, part, one of these. So yeah, that's what I was thinking about that. I'll go ahead and uh, do this by here. If I'll quickly go ahead and do that now. Okay guys, so here we are. A Two days later, and I've done this much work on it. We're almost complete here. I did loads more work on it. And as you can see, there are no white pieces here. That's because I redesigned it. So... What I've done is I've made it so that all of these overlap. So what's going to happen is these little segment pieces aren't going to be made. So I'm going to make an outline with these first, then fill them in with plates and like uh, maybe uh, make them different if it's an odd number. So that it makes it easier for me to get because obviously Lego makes plates in like even numbers. So one by fours. Uh, one by twos, one by sixes, one by eights. So it'll make it easier for me to get these done. Um, as you can see, this is what the trenches are looking like right now. I think that they're looking pretty, pretty, pretty good. As you can see. So I like now this is coming on quite a lot. So um, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to work a little bit on the mountain, and uh, I'll get back to you once I've done that. And this is what I've done with the mountain. So I'm happy with how it's come out with some of the white and the red. The dark red and the dark grey especially going together. And I put a bit of light grey in there to give it a bit of contrast. Um, I'm still um, and an about a colour for the wall. Um, but uh, thanks to Kylo Bricks, he's helping me decide what to do uh, with that. So I'm going to see what I uh, want to do with that too. Um, but yeah, this design I came up with. Um, I'm really happy with how it's turned out and I'm going to carry on this throughout here the next couple of segments just maybe at the end of each segment uh, as I get smaller orders maybe I might get one in bulk we'll see so um, yeah that's going to be the end of the video for today guys hopefully this will satisfy you with how long the video is if it was too long let me know if it was too if it was just the right time, tell me. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. For now, that's going to be it. Make sure you smash that like button. Make sure you hit that bell icon so that you'll get notified every single time I upload. And if you haven't already, the subscribe button. Because that will uh, let me know that there are more people who are enjoying my videos. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.